Howdy, this is Terry, and I've lost 180 pounds with keto, carnivore, and counting calories. Don't forget to click that like button and look at the description of this video. I have all kinds of links, and on my homepage, you'll see a bunch of playlists for how I lost my weight. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you. You know what we ain't done in a long time? Let me just show you. Let me just show you. Well, well, my music hits me so hard, makes me sick. Oh, my Lord, thank you for blessing me with the mind to rhyme and to write beat. Huh, 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 huh. It's hammer time. That's what I was playing whenever I come. <laughs> come up for Bible study and, uh, or uh, my life group, and that's what I was playing on the radio for the dogs. Some MC Hammer. I'm like, you singing, man, you go. All right, let's get our food ready for tomorrow. Now that you had a little, little, little rappy rap from a rappy rap from a little white girl. So I've got my two eggs cracked in here. As you know, I'm out of the stuff. So let's see what we're gonna do. We're gonna add in a wedge of laughing cow cheese. And next, we're going to add in, I can get it here, I have some, oh yeah, remember this weekend, I made some onion and mushrooms, I made them up, so we're going to put some of those in here, there we go, a little of that, and we have some uh, breakfast pork, I had found a whole bunch of yellow thicker pork and um, so I cooked it up in the crock pot a few few weeks ago and then I just put it in these containers so that I can scoop some in and um, so there's that and I think that's I, I know what before I was taking some avocado and stuff but I think I'm just gonna let that be that that should that's probably plenty so that's gonna be my breakfast so let's just set it back here out of the way um, let's go on and do our salad because we know I'm always going to take a salad. Oh, my stars and garters. Y'all, y'all, I've been gassy. I told you, <laughs> told y'all to chase my poor, my poor nurse. Thank goodness she's not new. I mean, she's been there. She's been with us a year now. So it's time for her to get fully indoctrinated into life with Terry. I chased her out of her own office. <laughs> earlier today because uh because i had i had a little gassy gas just a little gassy gas so uh anyway so she got introduced <laughs> she had 11 and a half months that's all you get man it's all you get being part of my team you're going to have to deal with the funk the funky 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 um, this is, I, you, if you look in the description for my, in this video, I have a link to whenever I made these. These are pickles, uh, well, they're cucumbers. I made them, um, I love all the different kinds of vinegars. So this is, and this lid is not going to fit, and I'm well aware of that. But I like the, um, the red wine vinegar and the white wine vinegar and the rice vinegar and all those vinegars is in here and it is amazing um, also in the description is when i made uh bread and butter pickles debbie sue sent gave us a link to that and i see this sitting here and i forgot i wanted to put a spoonful of my mina harissa into here i'm gonna start off my morning tomorrow with some with a powerful punch. Yeah, there we go. Just about, I don't know, a teaspoon. And I'm recommending that you do not lick your spoon. Now, you can lick it if you like the hot, spicy stuff. But I know I like my hot, spicy stuff kind of uh, uh, diluted a little bit. So, okay, so we have this. So now, let's see, what is this? Oh, that's the side. All right, so now I've got my dressing. And this is just a whole bunch of dressings mixed with water. So I try to do around 60 grams. Sometimes I do more. I'll never, I never do less. It was 68 this time. Go Terry, go Terry. It's your birthday, it's your birthday. Go 
Go Terry. Go Terry. It ain't my birthday. My birthday is February 7th. Oh, my goodness. Whenever I signed up at church, um, I had to fill out a form for church yesterday to, you know, to join. It was the wheel. And if you're as old as I am, you know, you know, you feel like you're on like uh, the price is right. And you just, whenever you have to go looking for your birth date and it starts at 2023 and you go, stop. Oh, no, not that far enough. Oh, there. Now we're getting closer. It's the, it's the eighties. Anyway, so whenever you have, you know, you have to do your phone and scroll down to get to the birth year. Yeah, if you're my age, you know what I'm referring to. Although some of you younger whippersnappers in your 40s, you're start, starting to experience it. Anyway. All right, so that's our salad, our breakfast and our salad. And I'm going to go ahead and take another spoon with me. I'm going to take an extra one because I used one today. So what I do is I keep all my food in a stack. I pull out two main dishes and a side dish for every day. And then, um, and then I also eat a salad every day. Well, I'm pulling the salad back out because I'm looking up here and I see I forgot my, uh, my, my, my dressings or my seasonings. We're going to put some ranch on here. We're going to do some guacamole and more. I'm too lazy to dig out my, um, my Greek seasoning. I have to dig pretty far. So then where's my everything? Baby, baby. Here we go, everything. Oh, come on, fella. All right, so everything bagel. I don't know why some things, when I talk to them, they're, they're fella, and some things are girl. I don't know what determines what, when I call something. Cars are always a girl, always a girl. You know, I had, I had Bessie and Tawanda. I don't know why, vehicles are always a girl in my head. And, uh, but I don't know, inanimate objects, there's no rhyme or reason for whether I say fella or girl. All right, so that is cubed something. I'm going to bet that that's probably rutabaga. But anyway, my side dish, I always have with supper. Because for lunch, I need it to last from 11 until 5. That's the longest time. So I need, I have that big salad. So I always have a salad with lunch. So this one, oh, steak. I don't even remember when I made that last, but... Steak or what do we have in here? Ooh, the pork with the onion gravy. I told y'all that um, when you freeze it and, and defrost it, it separates. You see that liquid? That's the oniony part there, and then there's the liquid. Um, man, I'm taking my pork. I'm taking. I don't even have to season that. All I have to do is put that in there. Cause man, that's some good stuff. Who nailed it? Oh, I forgot an apple. Hold on. Y'all, look at this big honking thing. Ain't that a big old apple? It's almost, it's like, oh, wait, no, there's my finger. It's like, it's like a fourth of my head. But look at it, it's big. Anyway, this is a cosmic apple. Instead of buying a bag, I, I went the expensive route and got all big ones. But I thought, you know, in the end, I either bring two of those ones in the bag because they're so rinky-dink. So why not just go on and buy a big one and uh, have that? So, yeah. So put that in here. And so, yeah. So I'm trying to think. I've got breakfast and lunch. I just feel like I've got, I don't have a lot. But it's because I put so much food in with my with my eggs. If you remember it before, like I said, I was bringing avocado. But I feel like that really is plenty right here. I don't need to take any more. The only other thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put a scoop of my... I, I make my own chocolate electrolytes. There's a link down in the description. Um, and so I'm going to do that. And then... I'll have this over here and ready to go for in the morning. Finally got me some cups that fit under there. Yay! And then uh, these coffee, it fits, this little thing, it fits about one and a half scoop. Okay. Yeah, one and a half scoops. So, 
This is pretty, this packs a pretty powerful punch. So I have to be careful because this particular thing, it pops open. So I'm just going to set it down here before I set it down and it flopped over. Hey, I could do this. I can set it down in this little cup. I don't know why. Just so that, just because I want to. So there we go. I'll set this down here and tomorrow morning I'll pop it in and I'll have my electrolyte coffee and I'll be good to go. So I'm going to put all the rest of this away and I'll see you at breakfast. Bye. Good morning. I've got my breakfast. I microwave it. I put it all together this time. Um, I know before I would do like my eggs separate and then I'd add in something and then I'd add in something and it was a lot easier. It probably microwave for about mm, three minutes total maybe. Oh, I forgot seasoning. Hang on. I don't need any of my, uh, of the uh, Creole seasoning because it's got the, um, that's the spicy, I can't remember what it's called right now. Uh, uh, Mina Harissa, it's got that in it. So, I'm probably, I probably should wait. But you know me, I never do. So, but here's, that's how it looks. And so that's going to be my breakfast. Let me get you down so you can see. So it's got the onions and mushrooms and cheese and and, and salt, uh, pork, ground pork. Um, and the mean harissa and some salt and eggs. Mm-hmm. That's good. So, <clears throat> Looks like my version of oatmeal this morning. Okay, bye. Hey, it's lunchtime, and I have my my um, what is this? My pork and onion gravy. Mhm. Mm and my salad. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm I'll see you at supper. It's later than I normally eat. It's 6.15. I went to the thrift store. <clears throat> I went to Goodwill today. And um, that's going to be a separate video because it's 6 o'clock and I ain't got time to try everything on. Because you don't get to try things on. My tongue is frozen so I might be slurring. Because um, I ate I ate a couple pieces of my frozen fruit. Anyway, um, at the Goodwill... You, they, they don't have dressing rooms that you can try things on in. So I bought several different things, and so um, I don't know how they're going to fit. So I'm like, well, I'll get them and see what I think. And, um, yeah. So, and then also went to Kato's, because like I said, I got this event coming up that I needed a couple nice outfits for. So, later on, probably this weekend, I'll try them on and show y'all, but like I said, I just... It's 6 o'clock. I got to get food in my belly because I'm going to get hangry. So let me show you what I got. I already microwaved it. It's a steak. So we're going to put some of my farm dust seasoning on here. And then we're going to put some of my garlic lovers because uh, garlic on anything, yes please. So we're going to have us steak. And uh, I'm pretty sure, I'm 99.9% .9 sure that this is rutabaga. But we're going to find out. So hold on. Obviously, we got to try the steak first. So let's get a bite of steak. Hopefully, it's not still hot. Hey. Right. Well, hang on. These two are... Sammy and Baxter are acting funny. They were having a disagreement. Three kibble pieces fell on the floor and they were back behind something. And Sammy wanted to get them and Baxter wanted to get them. So anyway, they're, it's gone now. So I heard some, I heard Baxter going, grr, grr. And he, he's food, he's food assertive. But Lewis too, it's funny when those two go at each other. Now keep in mind, if dogs want to hurt something, they will close their mouth. But when these guys go at each other, they're like, ah, ah, and just try to be who's the loudest and make their mouth the biggest. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's rutabaga. 
I think I did make a roasted rutabaga and just didn't record it one time. So that's roasted rutabaga. So bega, and steak, and fruit, and that's my supper. Oh, yeah. So anyway, so at Kato's, I got two, like one dress, one like a jumper kind of thing. I ain't never bought a jumper in my life. It was funny because I went in there and I'm like, um, I've never shopped on this side of the store before. I need help. Because I've always been in the plus size, plus size section or I've gone to Lane Bryant and they have to dress me there too. But anyway, this girl, she was so sweet. She was like, oh yeah, what do you want and what are you looking for? So I found a couple dresses. Or I found those two things on the clearance rack for like 15, 16, something. But they were sleeveless. Which I was okay with because I knew I needed something to cover it. So the girl was so sweet. She helped me find a sweater to go over the dress. Like a white cardigan sweater. And on the one. And the other one. I don't remember. There's another cardigan sweater to go over the other one. I think that one's cream. So um, she dressed me. And I got some boots. Some cute boots. Mm. Oh, necklace from Kato. Goodwill. They are definitely more expensive than the Teen Challenge and the Women's Safe House. Across the board, more expensive. Um, but I got three pair of jeans. I think like three sweaters. Three dresses. A pair of boots. And then three cardigan type sweaters. Two or three. I didn't know which one I'd like, so I got three different styles, so that way I could, you know, figure it out. All right, I'm going to eat. This video is going to be too long. I'll see you next time.